calls for the use of a health system approach in the management of COVID-19 responses and the continued importance of accurate reportage by journalists have been reiterated in uh, this report by PLOS TV Africa's Felicity Ezewike. To get it right, Nigeria must integrate COVID-19 responses into the country's health system and Nigerians act decisively to ensure her leaders operate an accountable system for the billions of Naira dedicated to its containment. Professor of Health Economics, Systems and Policy, Obinna Ongjekwe, gave this piece of advice at a virtual media roundtable organized by the Nigerian Academy of Science with the theme COVID-19 and you. Uh, many countries are already leveraging on the opportunity of COVID-19 to strengthen everything from human resources, for financing, from governance. But what are we doing in Nigeria? Uh, because in Nigeria, the response to COVID-19 is more a vertical thing. It's not integrated into the system. So we're running it as if it's a standalone thing. And then without this integration into the system, at the end of it, it's going to be like Ebola. Of the donations, this is what he had to say. It's quite important that we, we interrogate, you know, the spending of this money, these billions, where have they gone to? You read somewhere that uh, 20,000 Naira was used to buy a mask, one face mask, 20,000 Naira. You know, these are, but we're not seeing all these things being brought out in the press, in the media. So let's, more emphasis should be put on ensuring accountability across stakeholders, showing that, you know, the funding supports the building of a resilient health system. Another speaker, who is an Associate Medical Director for Patient Safety, Professor Rotimi Jayesimi, on his part, identifies inaccurate data and poor reportage among the factors promoting myths and misinformation about the COVID-19 virus in Nigeria, which according to him needs to stop. He tasks journalists not to be fatigued in educating the people. Nigeria has not reached the peak. We are far from flattening the curve. And so there is the need to dispel the myths and the misinformation that exist. Now, countering disinformation is a public service, and that is where you come in. I listened to one of the presidential task force briefing, and they said everybody's tired about this virus now, including the media men. My plea to you is that please do not get tired, do not get weary about this thing. Founded in 1999, the Nigerian Academy of Science is a national not-for-profit organization and the foremost independent scientific body dedicated to the development and advancement of science, technology and innovation in Nigeria. For Plus TV Africa, Felicity Ezewike.